Hey everyone, and welcome back to another one of my Fallout 4 videos. This is part 25 of my Fallout 4 series. I hope you guys enjoy this just as much as I do. Had a lot of fun making it. Minutemen fucking suck dick. Let's get into this. Speak to Paladin Dance. That's for the Brotherhood of Steel, but we're not ready for that one. Raiders, kill the Raiders at Black Street. Back Street Apparel. That one kind of sounds fun. And the nearby gang of Raiders has been terrorizing Oberlin Station. I need to find them and make sure they'll never be a threat to anyone else again. That's pretty nice, but I don't think that's one of the Minutemen. I don't think that's one of the Minutemen missions. I don't know who assigned that. Let's do the Raider Troubles at Oberlin Station. Hopefully it's not one of the Minutemen. But if it is, oh well. We might get a little bit of caps on the side or something. How far away is it anyways? Look on the map. Not that far away. Or that's not it. Oh gosh. Alright, we're gonna be doing some gonna be doing some hiking today, so I'll catch you guys in a little bit once I get there. Okay. I'm a little over halfway now. Almost to there, and that vehicle just fell off the bridge. So I really hope it doesn't blow up. Well, I guess it'd be pretty badass right now if it blown up. But if I'm too close to it and it blows up, then it's gonna be a little bit, a little bit different. Don't know quite how that happened. I guess it fell through the. I don't know physics. Something to do with physics on Fallout 4. Anyways, fuck that car. I just climbed up these this scaffold here. And I think I hear footsteps on the other side of this. Yeah, I do. I hear footsteps on the other side of this, and there's a lock pick here, but I can't get into it because it's advanced, unfortunately. But maybe there's another way around. Sounds like a mole rat, maybe? I don't know. There has to be a way around here that we can get inside that building now and check it out. Oh, shit! Okay, we're very lucky. We just survived there. Oh my gosh, here's another one. Get that. Oh gosh. That was crazy. That got my that got me pumped. I'm ready to kill some shit now. We really need to watch out for some oh not bull rats at schools. Need to be careful here about mines. I'm actually gonna go back through here and see whether I could find any more mines. Or see any that way in case if I need to run I'm not hitting into any mines we haven't saved in a bed yet so we need to oh gosh this place is infested with ghouls probably smarter idea is to find a bed first so I'll let me do that just head down this alley and I'm scared cuz it just looks so I don't know it just looks like something bad's gonna be on the other side of this alleyway I still haven't found a bed. Oh, this is the Brotherhood. Alright. Take this. Shotgun shell. 10 millimeter. 24 of those. 10 millimeter round once again. Fusion cells. Nice. These ghouls are now rotting. Let's get back into this Cambridge police station. Bandages on. Okay, I'm in now in the Brotherhood. The Brotherhood of Steel. I, I don't know. This isn't their actual like base, but it's kind of like a hideout, I think. Sorry about the other guys. There has to be a bed in here. I'm just gonna kind of loot everything in here actually and take it. Scribe Halen's personal log. I'm gonna actually play that. Steel Scribe Halen, personal log entry 324A. I'm starting to wonder if joining the Brotherhood of Steel was a good choice. I originally signed up seeking protection and comradeship, but. I'm worried that I've traded away a bit of my humanity in the process. The Brotherhood's message of hope for the future is idealistic and noble, but their methods leave a lot to be desired. The leadership seems especially misguided. Instead of diplomacy, they wield violent confrontation to exert control. Despite all that, I've been successfully avoiding the fighting by following the career path of a field scribe. 
I suppose only time will tell how long I can stand the sight of spilled blood over my own moral fiber. Uh. Well, I guess she's not sure whether she likes it or not or something. I don't know, but we're finding lots of good loot in here. Rad X. We've just found, like, I don't know, like 20 millimeter, 10 millimeter rounds, fusion cells. There's lots of stuff in here. Lots of goodies. So I'm just picking up all of these. Might as well. They're free. Military fatigues. Ooh, we might put those on, actually. Oh, never mind. We got the spike armor. That's right. I kind of want to change out of this spike armor. It's cool and all, but I've had it for a while and I want to change it. Novice. Cambridge Police Evidence Terminal. Sweet. Okay, I'm in now. Case 096. I don't want to read all this stuff. <laughs> Cambridge Police Station Motor Pool. Yeah, I don't think we want to go down there. Let's see if we can find that bed that we were talking about that we wanted. What? I don't think we've been in here either. Some some sort of jail cell. Which is actually kind of interesting. I wonder if they actually keep people in here or not. I've never seen that, but... Herbal antimicrobial? I don't know how to pronounce that, but I'm taking it. There has to be... Here's a bed. A bedroll. Sleeping bag. Nice. Let's get us rested. Eight hours. Eh. I don't want that much. I just want a little bit. Maybe like two hours is good for me. Just got rested. And I'm now in, out in the wasteland and it's beautiful out. A nice sunny day. New Coca-Cola sign right there. Shots off in the distance. Let's see what we can get ourselves into today. We were gonna do that mission. I think we want I don't think we want to go off to the shots. I think we want to go to this mission. Stay on our quest trail. Uh oh. Thumbs going on here. Someone, please, help! This thing is gonna kill me. No more from you. You're not I, I need to kill them before they. You can't do this. Anyone, please. I gotta do something. Oh. oh shit! I forgot he has a shotgun. We don't want to get too close to that guy. Why did I even shoot him? Nice. That guy's got some skill. Bottle cap, shotgun shells. Scavenger? Nah, I don't want that. Let's talk to this guy. I just helped him. He should be... He should be happy <clears throat> for that. Please. I... I just want to be alone. Well, that's bullshit. I just helped you. I wonder if I should have shot this guy instead. I don't know. I might have just missed some dialogue, but... That's alright. Look at all this Nuka Cherry. Pack of cigarettes. I guess that's it. Let's get on with the mission. Bobby pins. Pretty nice stuff. It's actually a pretty nice town to loot around in. A little bit dangerous, but not so bad once you get used to it. Look at here is a little diner or something. A bone saw? Oh, that sounds terrible. I want that. Uh, let's see here. Cash register. 17 pre-war money. 14 pre-war money. We just got 30 pre-war money all together. Like 31 or something like that. Got to be very careful about these. Sometimes they have little babies in them. And you go up to them and they're timed explosives. They're like little dolls. Got to be very careful sometimes about approaching those. Brahmin skull, bottle cap, fusion cell, nice. That's all good stuff. I wonder if there's anything in these preservations. Yep, there sure is. A dinner fork. 
What's this? A toy alien? Wooden block? I don't want any of that shit. How far away are we from our... We're not that far away. We, we're gonna have to cross this bridge and then take a left. And there are raiders here. I think we can avoid them though. Take a look over here. I don't see anything so far. Oh, there's one. Raider scum. I don't really want to mess with those guys right now. 93 meters from our mission. We're almost to our mission now. And I am hearing some massive footsteps. Do you hear that? Or is that just me? Because there is some massive footsteps on the other side of this building somewhere. But, looks like we do got ourselves some loot. Not the best. But let's be very aware of those footsteps. Let's check in here real fast. Might be something in here. Sure is. Duct tape. Ball peen hammer. Not going to be taking that. What did we get out of the Vault Tech lunchbox? A pen? Ah. Shitty loot. Anyways. Our mission is literally right out. Oh gosh, there's a ton of them. Gotta get out of here. Relocate. Oh, I know what I was hearing. I was hearing a raider in power armor. We definitely do not want to be... Getting in a fight with that guy. That guy will fuck us up. A machine gun turret MK1. Can we hit this guy? No. We're very terrible at aiming. I'm very terrible at aiming. Look at this. Nice. That's a machine gun turret MK1. What the fuck? Oh, it must have been right back there somewhere. He must not be shooting at me. I'm gonna use a stim pack. I hear massive footsteps. Don't know where that's at. Where's this machine gun turret? Is that one right there inside that? What the fuck? That's one inside that cart right there. That's not the one that was shooting at us though. That's funny, this one can't even like, do anything. Nice. Now, where's that other machine gun turret? There he is. Oh, he's aimbotting us through the wall. At least he can't shoot us. Oh, maybe he can. Dang, that turret's pissed off. Not bad at all. Now let's take a look and see what kind of loot we can find around here. 22. 32 millimeters. Pipe pistol. Not that great of stuff, but I'll take it. What's this? Jet mintats. Alright, I'm going into this place. Going into this place and I'm... Gonna fuck everything up in there. Uh-oh, they already know I'm here. Probably better run. Well, that wasn't that great. Did I have on my flashlight or something? Because they seen me instantly. I didn't have on my flashlight. I don't know why. Don't know how they seen me so fast. I'm going to wait for my sneak to go, or my caution meter to go all the way up to hidden. And then I'll head back in there. But I'm going to be going in there a lot more stealthy this time. Going to be actually going in there in the sneak, the sneak position. While crouched. Was that? I found him. Oh, I'm back in here again, and they already know that I'm here. 
I'm thinking maybe I should find a bed or something before I do go in there. Just in case I die, I don't have to restart all the way back. We're here. To some place. And I'm thinking that maybe... Uh-oh. Glowing rad roach. I'm thinking that maybe there might be a bed in here somewhere. Surprised that thing wasn't like a legendary or something. It actually kind of sucked. Can we get that with the switchblade? I'm gonna get this one with the shotgun. He almost just hit us there. Uh oh. Uh oh. We got an agile one. Imagine how, like, horrifying that would be in real life to have one of these things walking around down on the ground speeding like that fast and could kill you oh, I already hate cockroaches in general scalpels scissors here's something oh, are you fucking serious are we glitched well that sucks yeah there's a glitch every once in a while in Fallout 4 where you go into a terminal and for some reason the PC the PC version the FPS is like not synced or something and it like goes past your your FP I don't know exactly how it works but it, it freezes your game it freezes the terminal and you have to start all the way over so you know what that means guys I have to restart all the way over again so at least it's another beautiful day out uh I guess I'll catch you guys back there. Hopefully that computer terminal doesn't do that again. That's really uh, irritating when it does that too because especially in survival mode. But I'll catch you guys back there where I left off. Okay, so guys, this little market right here, I, I actually made it back. Anna's Cafe. We will have to clear out the raiders again outside the mission, but that's all right. Anna's Cafe. This has a sleeping bed. It has a sleeping bag in here. So let's get some hours in. I'm thinking two. All right. Now since we got some hours of sleep in. By the way, there was two stim packs in here, and I did take them, so I'm very happy about that. Let's see what else we could find in here, though. Pork and beans, sugar bombs. What's that? Nuka Cola. I'll take that. What's that down there? Nothing. this desktop picture frame 10 millimeter jar box not interested let's get out of here get back to that mission um <laughs> is that skeleton this is gonna be fun. oh shit I remember that girl now being there. I think I'm going to try getting a Molotov on this one. Oh, nice hit too. That wasn't bad. Remember that turret. If I work my way around, it's going to take a little bit. So I think I'm just going to try shooting him from here. Where's he at? Here he is. Ah, little bastard. He's an aimbotter, that's for sure. I could, like, get one hit. One hit on him at a time. It, there has to be some place I can get here at an angle that he can't shoot us, but we can shoot him. Here we go. Yeah, now we're talking. Come on. Do you, do you hear him? He tried shooting at the very end there to try and kill us. But it was too late for him. Now, this one in the car. I want to get a better look at this one. <laughs> 1,000 rounds. 5.56. Five, I wonder if that's like... 
I wonder if I wonder if I like got in front of this car. I wonder if he could shoot at me. I'm gonna try it. Hey guys, I was just gonna apologize for the audio sync. I think it was a little bit out of sync in this video. Hopefully next video will be a little bit better. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to leave a comment down below and I'll catch you guys later.